In today's video, I'll be reviewing and swatching one of the Beatles gel nail kits. Hi, it's me, Van Z. No, I'm kidding. Hey, I got another product to review. Hey, pay attention to this video. I think this is a great product. This is the Beatles gel nail polish set in the color Midnight Euphoria. I It has like 20 colors in it. I constantly am trying out new things. So, hey, take, stay tuned and let me know if you like it. Bye. Van Zieg. <laughs> Wait a minute. Well, I'm not really joking, but in all seriousness, Van Zieg, the name is inspired from my actual name. I am literally trying to build a brand on my name. But um, yeah, it's just literally my name. V-A Vanessa, that's my first name. And for Nicole, that's yeah my middle name. And Zieg is like, the first four letters of my last name. Well, Ziegler Hedger now, but my maiden name, Z-E-I-G. So there you have it, Van Z. That's where it came from. Now, without further ado, on to the video. Ooh, what is it? This is the Beatles 20 Gel Nail Polish Kit in the color Midnight Euphoria Collection, purple, blue, hot pink glitter. I can't wait to try these. Packaging is nice, it's uh, very basic, it just has in there the, um, the polishes, this is an application guide, you know, I'll be reading this for <laughs> later because, you know, reading is fundamental. Um, they give us a bunch of stuff here, so let's see, there's full size matte top coat, there's a um, full size glossy top coat, and a full size base gel nail, gel, and I just realized video here is, is both a matte and a gloss so there's options so you can have two different looks with all these colors um, there are 20 colors included in this Beatles gel nail polish kit um, I picked these colors because I wanted something pink sometimes and sometimes I wanted some basic colors very beautiful very nice I'm so excited so far um, the gel polishes don't have um, names on them they just have numbers so without further ado, let's uh, do some swatching. Yeah, I got these uh, swatch sticks off of Amazon. I can link those below. Here's the first color. Um, it's a very beautiful, like, um, sparkly blue um, polish. Oh, I called it glittery dark blue. Color is Alpha or A700. Very pretty, very shimmery. I don't know if I caught it here on camera. It's my first one, so I probably was rushing. But uh, yeah, it's a very pretty color so far. Um, I do, did, um, after each swatch, just cure the color for 30 seconds. If it was like really, really light sheer, like a clear almost, I would do a second so a uh, second coat. But if they're dark enough, I would just do one coat. That way I save product for when I choose to use them in the future. Keep watching. Oh, and I know it's kind of out of place, but I forgot to mention that I do like that it gave us a tray to store these in in case you don't have anything. Okay, so this next color is a dark pink color. I didn't have a name, so I'm just making it up as I go. Uh, I think it's very pretty. I think it can be used in, you know, with some Valentine's Day nails or just whatever you want. Overall, it's just a pretty color. And I was amazed that when I'm swatching these, the, um, the pigments are so, I don't know how else to say, but creamy or just thick. It only takes one coat for each. This next color is like a pinkish purple. I guess you would call it fuchsia. Keep watching. So this next color is black. I mean, I had to come back on here because this black is so dark. Like usually, I don't know people who usually do their nails, but oh my God, it's like literally one coat and that never happens for a black nail polish. I usually have to go on that thing like 
two or three times before I get it to look like this dark. So I wasn't expecting that. Good, good on you, Beatles, because that was amazing. All right, so this next color is a dark pink. Um, another very pretty color. I like it for the spring. I like it for Valentine's. Or just someone, somebody who just wants to wear some pink. Hey, get your pink in. This is very pigmented. Another one coater, you know, like, you can't go wrong with this color. Look at that. Look how smooth it goes on. Like, I'm in love with these polishes. I think y'all should definitely go buy it. And, you know, just keep them in stock if you're not one that wears it all the time. Alright, so this color is a light green, like a pastel green. Color number is A695. I think it's so pretty. I already love greens as it is, so this is actually motivating me to want to create a like pastel spring looking color set or something. Oh, this purple is so pretty. It's like a light color, again, in that pastel line, you know? Great for spring colors, or if you just love the color, use it, you know? Yeah, I think I, um, after this, I think I'm gonna be using these colors sooner than later on a cute set, but y'all stay tuned for that in the very near future. <laughs> So here's another pastel purple color. I guess the last one was like a, a lighter pastel purple color. This one's like a darker pastel purple. Also very pretty. Uh, mix is again motivating me to want to use it. How creamy and smooth that is. Oh, and it's so vibrant. I can't talk now. Vibrant in the color. And this is a deep purple. Oh, it's making me want to like just use this color. So look at this. Look, look how pretty that is. Like oh my goodness. I can't get over how pretty these colors are. It makes me want to go buy, like, all their colors, honestly. Like, look at that. Oh, great. I'm already thinking, like, Halloween stuff or just a purple set. Just, oh, ooh, with all the different genres of purple I have in this set I could use. If you're new to watching me, um, I'm new to YouTube as well. Help me out. You know, if you like my content, please like and share and subscribe. That way I can continue to make it more. Yeah, I had been thinking about starting to actually post things for so long. Look at that purple. But I just never had the courage. And now I do after watching so many other uh, women out there, you know, just going after what they, what they like, a, a hobby. And it's like... They became instant success on YouTube because of it. Like, what's their name? Um, Long Hair Pretty Nails or Nails by Key. And, you know, this is all they do. It's like a hobby and it's so fun. It's, it's like something they're doing anyway every day. Okay, so this is a blue, looks like. Oh, yeah, like a royal blue. Again, pigmented. One coat is working. Like, you, you can't say nothing bad about this set. Look at that. Just smooth. So this next color is a pearl, opaque-ish, white, sheer color. It has like, um, kind of like a iridescent sheen to it. So it reminds me of like a pearl color, like you would put on top of your nails if you are painting your nails. Not necessarily the pearl color because it's very sheer, so I don't think it would work very well as a singular by itself thing, but it, you know, it might, who knows? So I see it like something I would put on top of like maybe a black nail or on top of a white nail, you know, it's very sheer. Because it was so sheer, I decided to give it, you know, another coat just to just make sure that I'm giving it everything I can to show how pretty it is. It's, it's pretty on its own, but I really think it's more of a, you know, a topper. 
And the next one is a shimmery sheer iridescent white color. You'll see what I mean. It's like it's also very sheer, it's shimmery, it's not necessarily pearl. I would say it has more of a um, glitter in it than like a iridescent thing. But you'll see it here in the example. I did two coats on it too because it's also very sheer. Like I said, if they're very sheer, go ahead and do two coats to, you know, give it a little bit more pop against that, uh, against what you see there on my napkin or <laughs> if I bring it back in the frame. Oh, I was uh, curing it, but yeah, see how shimmery it is? I wish I did a close-up on it, but it's like, it has glitters and stuff in it. Very pretty. So this next color is a, I would say a silver glitter. Again, I don't know if it worked as a, a, a thing by itself, but definitely, excuse that vehicle going by so loud, ugh. But yeah, and excuse my AC going in the background, I haven't got my microphone yet in the mail, so once that comes, it'll be a little better on the sound. But as I was saying, this is like a silver um, glitter. I would say as a topper, it'd be great. Not necessarily by itself, it could be by itself if you're looking for that sheer look, but also very pretty not me personally i would use it like on top of a darker color oh my gosh now this one this if y'all don't know y'all will know blue green teal turquoise whatever you want to call it this is like my most favorite color in the world i almost like fainted when i pulled this color out i was like oh it's so pretty i gotta find a way to use it in the near future but for now again it's a glitter so i would definitely use it as a topper on something look how pretty that is i'm gonna do a second coat as well just to give it more pop so you can actually see it look how much glitter is in that so pretty I was so excited to see another beautiful teal color in this set. Oh, look at it. It's so creamy. It's so vibrant. It's so pretty. Oh, so excited. Um, I know it comes off kind of like baby blue almost in the video, but it's actually really like a teal color. But um, yeah, I can't wait to use this. I'm so excited. So this color is like a hot pink. Well, it comes off like a hot pink to me. Yeah, if you see, it's very, very bright. Um, I do like pink, but I'm not like a pink per se person. But this pink, it got me excited. I was like, wow, that is so bright and pretty. Like, they did not skimp on the pigment in these freaking polishes, y'all. Seriously, go get this set. Like, it has an array of colors. And that bright pink just like sold me. Like, for real, for real. This one's a glitter sheer pink. Oh, uh, look how shimmery it is. Again, it's a sheer color, so that probably works better as a topper. Unless you're going for a sheer look on your nails, I think it'd be a great addition. Yeah, definitely. This one's a, like a purple glitter. Um, also a sheer glitter. Um, very, very, it has lots of glitter in it. Very shimmery, again, probably works better as a topper, but it can work alone as well. Here's another purple glitter one. I call it sheer glitter purple. Um, I know I already have a purple one, but this one's also purple. It's just like a darker purple, but also very shimmery. Oh, so pretty, look at that. Oh my god. Y'all, go get this set. Seriously, look at that. Alright, so this one's like a blue, uh, a co cobalt blue. 
highly pigmented again like the color is vibrant it's there i think this would be perfect for like i don't know like a spring set as well just giving very pretty right all right that's all 20 of the colors um i did want to test out the matte top coat so i'm just doing like half a nail in this matte top coat just to, so y'all can see the difference now doing this this gives you like another whole 20 sets but in matte well again there you have it it's like 20 colors y'all like i have never bought such a great set and all the colors are popping like no matter which one you pick it's gonna look good no matter what so again, thank you for watching. If you made it this far, please again hit that like, subscribe, and share button. And just, you know, give me a chance. Um, I do do a lot of this girly stuff. Oh, these colors, y'all. Oh my gosh, so pretty. But I'm into beauty. I'm into fashion. I'm a mom. I'm in the army. I'm just a regular person. And um, I'm starting to, as I get closer to the end of my career. Look at these shimmers, y'all. Oh, so pretty. I, as I'm getting closer to the end of my career, I'm just, you know, reaching out and actually trying to, you know, get out there and do some of my hobbies, some of these things I love, you know, and, you know, have fun. All right. Love y'all.